Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Jay Holloway. Today, we're going to be discussing not last week, but the week prior's fragrances. I was supposed to have this filmed before my uh, mini vacation slash not vacation, but I was rushing to get to my destination before it got dark and I wasn't able to film, but alas, we are here. So, for that previous Monday, I decided to kick the week off with Exalté by Fumi Monet. This is the original bottle. It is no longer available in this big bottle. So, I nursed this and hold on to it because it is such a beautiful, rosy, champagne-y fragrance. Keeping with the theme of rose... That evening, I went with A La Rose by MFK or Mason Francis Kirkjohn. This is almost on its way out. And it's going to make me really, really sad because I do enjoy it. But that was Monday. Tuesday. Metallique by Tom Ford. This is a wonderful... Vanilla, cold, metallic fragrance. This has been discontinued, which makes me sad because it is really, really good. If you're able to get it, find it at a discounter, get it, you won't regret it. Sticking with the theme of coldness, I went with Siberian Rose the evening of Tuesday. I'm making a dent in this, the more that it sets, the more that it is changing. Still get the floral aspects, but this is very much, to me, a cold fragrance, almost akin to how this was a cold vanilla. This is almost like a cold rose. Something very not nice about it, but in a beautiful way. Wednesday, I wanted to smell different. And so I went with a discontinued scent by MFK called Lumiere Noir Homme. This is rose and patchouli. And I don't know what made me reach for this other than the fact that I was in the mood for it. And I think it was kind of cold that day. But I really, really like this. And I feel like, although it's discontinued now, they might re-release this in the future. But yes. And then for that evening, we went with Tom Ford's Florida Portofino. And I know I reached for this because A, it's almost gone. And B, it was kind of hot that day. For this to be October, it's been kind of warm. Then I was in the mood for Chanel, feeling real classic, real demure. I did Coco in the morning, very much 80s fragrance we love. And as you can see, almost out. And that evening, in the spirit of the Marilyn Monroe, Chanel number five EDP. Classic, beautiful, floral, and also almost gone. And then Friday, I want it to smell like caramel glacé or Dacus Arom's rendition of Lyra. Because it is beautiful. If you have not seen my Zerzhov collection, it is currently up on the channel. Get that. And then for the weekend, it was a mix of Princess and also Cosmic. And this is what I also had on for vacation. But like the actual last week, I was going through some samples. So you'll be seeing a long video of the samples that I wore last week. But y'all, this is that delayed fragrance of the week video that I owed you. 
Please like, comment, subscribe, share if you care. Stay tuned for more Sintic content. Bye.